we are taking a look at the newest floor plan from Alliance. This one being their smallest fifth wheel, perfect for couples. This is the 2024 Alliance Avenue All Access Model 24RK. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. Again today, I am super excited to show you this very small, very lightweight fifth wheel. This fifth wheel is actually almost smaller than my travel child. Before I begin, gotta say hi to Will. Hey Will! Hey guys! How's it going today? It's going good guys. We are, where are we Matt? We are here looks, at the all new General RV. Where's that at? Uh, in the, where are we? Like Fort Pierce, area. Port St. Lu Port yeah. St. Lucie area, but we're in Fort Pierce. Yeah, exactly. And um, guys, I'm so excited to take a look at this avenue. Now on the inside, you guys are gonna be like, man, this is small, but it's so big for like how small it is, if, it make, if that makes sense. And I think you guys will see when you, when you get in the inside and hear the specs. Yes, well, it's a lot like me, a small, small frame with a big personality. You know? Yeah. Well, maybe not a small frame, but you know what I'm saying. Also, if you guys haven't seen, the new Fort Pierce stores is open. And me, Will, and Jen, we did like a little tour of the dealership just to go over what brands that they sell here on the east coast of Florida. So it's very exciting. Well, you ready? I am. Let's begin. Model is Alliance Avenue All Access 24RK. The actual tip to tip length of this fifth wheel is only 29 feet, one inch. The dry weight is 7,170 pounds. The hitch weight is 1,375. 48 gallon gray wa uh, fresh water, 53 gray, 53 black. Now, Will, yeah. this fifth wheel is definitely what a lot would consider half ton towable. Yeah. Why isn't Alliance calling this half ton towable? Half ton towable is quite misleading. Yes. And uh, so they wanted to go with all access because the point they felt with that half ton segment it's more, it, it's not about towing you with a half ton truck. You really still want to get a three quarter ton with this, but it just makes it easier to maneuver, easier to drive. It's shorter, it's lighter, a little less. Parts. Yeah. You know, that's what they mean. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. There is a few trucks out there that could tow this. That's half ton. Yeah. But just cause you could doesn't mean. You should. Yes, sir. Nice painted fiberglass front cap here. LED light, strip light here. <clears throat> Kurt Rotoflex pin box there. And then underneath there, well, you do have storage underneath there with connection to your batteries. Cool. It's a very small fifth wheel. Yes. It does have four point electric leveling. Okay. Propane. Still has the big propane tanks. Yes, propane on the outside. And a little storage on the outside. They do have custom keys, the key like system. You open this up and well, even though this is a short, fifth wheel it's still 101 inch wide yes. body very nice they do use the pvc roofing really good storage right here again the storage is small but this fifth wheel is small well, yeah my travel trailer is almost longer than this fifth right wheel. i actually think it might be longer than this fifth wheel i think it is right over here will this is what makes this floor pan possible is these solid steps right now steps in the past they would have to be right there, which wouldn't work. Yep, or behind. But because because the steps used to be cut into the wheel wells. Right. Well, now that it's the solid steps, you're able to put these steps over the wheel wells. And then look at these tires. Well, they're good here endurance tires. ST225-75 or 15 with the Morai CRE 3000 suspension. And well, there's something huge, and I'm loving that they're putting it still on the all access series. Yes. What that is that? Is their performance running gear. This is one of the first things that really brought me on to Alliance. Talk to me. First, as you heard, they are using Goodyear Endurance tires. They're using Dexter Heavy Duty 3500 uh, springs, and then Heavy Duty wet bolts and uh, thick shackle, half inch thick shackles, and of course the Morai CRE 3000. Love that, it's just gonna be a better towing experience. Right, that's your foundation, like right here, this is what everything is, is sitting on and riding on, so it's so important um, to have that as good as you can. Just like your foundation. Yep. What are those? And then Asdell will. Asdell sits behind the fiberglass. Asdell is a composite and it will, will never delaminate on you. Very nice power awning with LED lights and Right here, we do have a Suburban instant hot tankless water heater. That's right. Now, this is an awesome feature, and this is brought to you by the Matt's RV Reviews team, okay? 
So when Will bought his avenue, which Will has now traded that in for a paradigm, that was during COVID shortages and they ran out of ladders. So right. the lines just hooked up these ladders. Yep. We called up Brian Brady. We said, this is the best ladder we've ever seen. Yep. And now this is industry standard for Alliance. These right. big, big ladders. Absolutely love that. 300 pounds. And it's just, it's just solid. You it know is. What I'm saying? Right here, we do have a hitch. Technically a 3,000 pound hitch with a four pin connector. Technically, you can tell behind it. Technically, we never recommend that. And it is prepped for a backup camera. There we go. All right, Will. <clears throat> Coming on, right there is one of your valves. That's probably a gray tank. Yes, it is. And then here, the other valve, 50 amp power cord. And here, it's locked. Oh, but, man. Man, we really messed up on we this did. one. We did. But this is your wet bay hookup and everything. Hang on. Good job getting the keys there, Will. Yeah. So what do we got going on here? In here, we have a really nice wet bay. So I like this because it's all enclosed. You can bring your hose and everything up through here. You got your city water connection, outdoor shower, potable water. Potable. Oh, potable. You got power out here, your pole valves, and black tank flush. I love that well. Yeah. Very, very nice. Other side of the storage. And as you guys have heard us say before, Alliance understands that things do go wrong. So they put this removable panel in here just so that it makes it easier to access all this water stuff. Love that. Love that. And right here is another propane tank. Very nice. Hold on one sec. Sorry, the gimbal's catching up. There Dang we go. gimbal. Dang gimbal. Nimble gimbal. And then right here, this is your auto leveling. Yes. But it's also where you're able to stand right here and watch how right. you get on and off your fifth wheel hitch. Well, it's like Alliance listens to customers. Right. Well, Will, the outside of this unit looks great, but the inside looks even better. Come on, Will, let's go, take a look. All right. Start with the kitchen first. Okay. Oh, and it's warranty for full timing in. Yes. So in the back here is this huge kitchen. Again, for the size that it is. Get these keys back. And then also it's kind of like a combo living space. Upstairs, we have the bathroom right here and the bedroom up front right here. Oh, wow. Well, look at this. You know who that is? No. That's ATC. That is the people that make the sensors. Oh, that certified liquefied that. sensor cleaner. Yep. So hopefully by the time this video is out, our sensor cleaner's out, and uh, our sensor cleaner is the only sensor cleaner that's um certified certified by, by them. Yep. Man, what a small world. Well, it's the RV world, so of course it's yeah. Be small. And well, with that said, why don't you show us the kitchen? All right. All right. So here in the kitchen. Great storage here. Nice Furion compressor fridge right there. Wow. Up top, nice storage. Okay. Oh, they're doing soft clothes. Okay. Wow. Nice window um, out the back. Extension faucet, big single bowl sink. Um, you have your instant tankless water here, here, power, max air fan, all that good stuff. And storage underneath. Would you look at that? Up top, tons of cabinet space in here. Solid surface countertops throughout the entire kitchen. Well, this looks different. This doesn't look like a regular avenue with that exposed wood look. Right. So they did, um, they're creating two options now as far as colors go in the avenue. So you Got can get it. this, or you can get like that natural wood look. Me personally, I prefer the natural wood. But um, you let us know in the comments what you guys like better. More countertop space here. Storage there. And then up top, like for how big this is, or really for how, like how small, small this is, is, there's tons of counters. It's a space. huge kitchen. Nice big residential microwave. Three burners, uh, Greystone cooktop. Yeah, man. With an oven and drawer underneath. That's real nice. And again, what's really nice is you have great countertop space on either side of this stove here. 
Tons of storage up top. More countertop space. Drawers, as you can see, they are all re reinforced underneath. So the bottom shouldn't collapse out. Hey, remember that time you punched through one? Did I? Yeah, remember you're like, look how strong it is and the oh, bottom no, fell out. So funny. Hang on, show that again. Oh, sorry. Storage right there. And then more storage right here. Yep. With this nice, like, multi-purpose, you know, kitchen space. Huge pantry here. Yes. I feel like this is a kitchen bigger than some, like, full profile fit. Right. Else. It really, really is. Because you have all this storage over here as Unbelievable. well. And here. Wow. You have a nice little stand here with power and, I mean, with USB and USB-C. Good backsplash here. Huge coffee taco bar. Drawers. You know, storage here. And then your breakers and fuses right there. Good, good. And then finishing it up. Yep. Drawer here. Storage there. Bada bing, bada boom. Phew. Yes. That's a big kitchen for 29 feet. For a 29 foot fifth wheel. Oh, yeah. Under here, there's probably chairs maybe under the uh Yep, definitely. It definitely comes with chairs. Yeah. And then above sits the TV. That is a Sansui TV with a Furion sound system. And that does sit directly across from the theater seats. Yes. Now, this slide out is on a flush floor slide. I got very comfortable theater seats with cup holders here. Little remote holder there. Okay. And these are the parachute and theater seats. Yes. So they're very, very nice. I do have... These slow rise shades, not MCD, but they're still slow rise. And they're a gray tone that really matches the inside. Check out those beautiful balances. What do you say, Will? They look good, actually. They're simple, but have a little bit of design to them. And then notice these big atrium windows. I love them. This is such a small fifth wheel, but with these big windows, it makes it feel light and bright in here and fantastic. Nice. And then these lights are also... They control like this, but they're also dimmable. I, I've honestly always... There we go. I've never liked those switches. But they are dimmable, and some people do like the dimming factor. Yep. And again, that's the living room. You know, really, this unit's majority kitchen, to be honest. It with is. You. Um, but we will touch on that a little bit later. But first of all, do you know what time it is? It's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. MSRP on this fifth wheel here, a 2024 Alliance Avenue, is only $73,556. Will, that is MSRP on this unit. Now, sale price, I know what we can get these for, and hopefully you guys know what we can sell these for. But unfortunately, because this is a current model year, we're not allowed to advertise the current sale pricing that we have here at General RV. But we do have sale pricing. So if you're interested in buying an Alliance RV, all you got to do is go to generalrv.com slash Matt's Cash. We've linked it down in the YouTube description below. You guys can get there from mattsrvreviews.com or call 844-969-4033. Please reach out to us, Will, and a member of our team will help you guys get the absolute best price in America. And now, if Fort Myers is open by the time this video is up, we now sell Alliance in three spots in Florida, Ocala, Fort Pierce, and Fort Myers. That's right. Fantastic. Yep. Um, so we're selling them at the Hershey Show mm. and in every region. I have an Alliance Delta myself. Will has had an Alliance Avenue and now has an Alliance Paradigm. And we just love this brand, the Brady Brothers and everybody at Alliance. And so if you do choose to buy an Alliance, please reach out to us and our team. And we're going to put our best foot forward to getting you that phenomenal price. That's right. Now, Will, why don't you yeah. show people the reason why you bought a lights because that bathroom. Yes. But did you step in this one yet? Not this one. Oh, uh, I. It, it is an avenue all access. All access, right. So, okay. just so everybody knows, um, the all access doesn't make it an avenue. Like, right. it shares the name, but... It's different. They are different, yes. I will say there's no radius shower. Okay, well, that's good. You know what's so funny? This shower is better than what was in my Avenue. No, in your 32 RLS? Yeah. Really? I have a lot more headspace. Because remember, 
We had a big step up. Do you remember that? In the no. 32? No, I like, never took a shower in that one. Oh. Well, yeah, we had a big step up in that. But in here, we have tons of headspace. Really good width and depth. This definitely passes. Bing! That's a shower test seal of approval. It's, it's crazy to have a shower like that in here. I know. Really, really awesome storage. Really awesome storage. And then over here, we do have a mirrored medicine cabinet. Man. What? Did we forget the liquefied? No, I got it right here. Oh, uh, liquefied! Our brand of RV toilet treatment. Guys, go to primepoopmusician.com to pick up a bottle. And by the time this video is out, hopefully we have other products as well. But I don't want to say it if they're not yeah. out yet. Bam, just like that. Nice sink with epoxy pour countertops. Okay. Little sink bowl right there. It is, yeah. Okay. That right there. Zipper down. Porcelain in a half ton towable. An all access series. This is a prime poop in position. Bing! Nice. Very nice. Man, we were doubting it. And then over here in the master bedroom, second air conditioning. Love unit. it. No slide out up here, which really helps with that tongue weight. Right over here, we got tons of storage. Tons of storage. More Extremely storage. Extremely nice ca cabinetry. Doesn't it feel very solid? It really does. Yeah. This is the perfect fifth wheel for weekenders. Oh, yeah. That want to tow a fifth wheel, mm -hmm. but don't want a freaking paradigm. Yeah. Tons of space. Power, Power USB, 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 USB C. C. And then what's over there, Will? Over here, you have your TV backer, so you can hook up a TV. Your therm thermostat, your dimmer lights, all that good stuff. Nice closet space here with three drawers. Very nice. And did you open up that drawer? I Here's did not. the chairs. Nice. Very nice. And then open up that drawer there. I'm trying to figure out why there's coax here. <laughs> Damn, dude, that's funny, actually. Yeah. Why is sure. there a coax there? I don't know. But I guess you can have like a little mini TV right. next to your bed. Believe it or not, Andrea does do that, and she'll but she'll have her iPad right there. Yeah. But that is funny, dude. I didn't even notice that there right. was a coax there. Well, well, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time to give you three things that we love about this unit and three things that we don't like, Will. What do we do first? Three things we dislike. Yes. It's going to be hard, I think. I got two. You got two? Yep. Dislike number one, Will. Even though this is the smallest fifth wheel, it's still a fifth wheel, and they're still big. I feel like all fifth wheels need six-point auto leveling. There you go. Um, I'm totally fine with it being electric, but the six-point is just going to stabilize you so much better but nobody really in this size or price range is putting six point on but again just because nobody does it doesn't mean i don't not like it yep so that is dislike number one well what's this like number two well, i'm gonna steal yours i know what your number two was. yeah well, i was gonna make that number three but make it oh, number two okay. so this kitchen space is great but this bed like this uh living space it it feels like it's just this to be honest yeah you know, it's like you have your couch, and then everything else is kitchen. It's all kitchen. So. There is, like, no living room. There's, like, no living room. Yeah. And, like, even that's the walking space. And, yeah. And then even over here, like, even from, like, here on, it still that's feels like kitchen. kitchen. Yeah. Yeah. That's number two. Mm-hmm. Then, Will, we need a number three. I know. They did such a good job in here. Should we make it that coax? All right. Um... See, I was gonna say the queen bed, but that's I got standard, it. Right? No, I got it. Okay. I got it. Okay. It could count as a combo, but we're not going to. I don't like this pantry. Why is that? Because just... you got all that. You oh right, do a bigger have... couch or the something. The fact that there's just a two seater in here, the fact that it's theater seat, you know, they could have made this a very long sofa, a three seater sofa seat, something that makes it more living room and homey like. 
Yep. Um, and again, we love pantry, so we must have, but with how big the kitchen was and having this taco bar here. Yeah. You know, or even combination, this could have somehow, some way been like a little desk area. Maybe. I don't know. Right. Overall, well, fantastic fifth wheel at a fantastic price. That's three things we don't like about it. Now it's time for three things we love about this fifth wheel. Okay. Would you like to go first? Sure. Talk to me. My like is going to be my dislike as well. Talk I to me. I do love how huge this kitchen is. So the whole thing with it is that's not going to be for everybody though, right? Like if you're not cooking a lot, it's probably not the floor plan for you. But if you do like to cook... You have tons and tons of countertop space, a huge pantry, tons of storage, big sink. This is awesome if you really like cooking and you want something small. Not only that, I love how they're not giving you a dinette. They're giving you the bar stools. Yep. Love that. That is number one. Well, love number two for me is going to be that bathroom. The fact yeah. that, that shower was better than your shower, a 32 RLS, that toilet to prime poop position, everything about that bathroom in such a small unit is still so spacious fantastic yeah that's number two and then number three well it's going to be the fact that it's an alliance womp womp that sounds like a paid sponsorship but that's not what i mean it's not that it's an alliance the fact that it's an avenue and it's yeah. not an avenue it's an avenue all access but the quality features mm -hmm. of avenue they kept that stuff in they did yeah you know what i'm saying good year tires the running gears the as -del, you know what i'm saying the yep. flush floor slides You'll see, even in the Alliance, like the Valor all access, mm -hmm. they, they use a different slide out than a Valor. Right, right. But not in the Avenue brand. They did a really good job trying to keep in the Avenue all the same. And uh, it's just kick butt awesome in America. That's right. Well, well, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're ready to buy an Alliance and join the family, literally just like me and Will, I do want to disclose everybody. That me and Will did get good deals on alliances, obviously, right. because we represent the brand and work for a dealership. But there's one key factor. What's that? We still paid for them. We paid for it. And let me tell you something. There's no different than car dealership people drive demos. Yeah. We could have demoed these for a year. But I wanted to have my own. Will wanted we to have We could have demoed other own. brands for free, probably. Like we if could, we had asked. Not probably. even trying to say this. We could have gotten paid to right. demo brands, you know? Right. But for us, it wasn't about that. It was about staying true to what we like, promoting the brand that we love, and actually <clears throat> putting our money where our mouth is. Yep. That's it. God knows we put enough food in there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. You know, Travis is all like, oh, that's what I was thinking. Uh, right. 5483, no. Well, well, that's it. That's the review. If you guys are interested, please go to generalrv.com slash masscast. We've linked it down in the YouTube description below. You guys can get there from mattsrvreviews.com or call 844-969-4033. Again, the Fort Pierce store in the Port St. Lucie area is officially open. So now you guys have multiple areas in Florida where you can pick up an alliance and nobody's going to give you a better price than us. That's right, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. This is such a an awesome unit. And it really just packs a punch for the size that it is. Um, again, like Matt said, this is this is an awesome store. We're so excited to have it here. Matt and I will be filming here. And, um, yeah, can't wait to bring you guys new brands and new locations to um, get service done and help with sales and parts and all that good stuff. So make sure to leave down in the comments below. Let us know three things you like and three things you dislike about this unit. Make sure to smash the thumbs up button and subscribe. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And, Will, we'll see you next time.